Hello, my name is Iran and welcome to part 5 of my World 20 Master series. This is about the sidebar and in section 5.2 I'm going to talk about the second type of the sidebar which is images. This is not available for players, this is for guides only. When you open the images tab, this is what you're going to see. You have your premium assets here and your library here, whatever you've uploaded and whatever you've purchased. You can start browsing here for whatever things you've bought on the marketplace or look around for free assets available to everyone. Over on the other side of the images tab is the library, which includes everything I've uploaded and sorted onto Roll20. The way I recommend you handle this is you put in folders for whatever you want, for example, quantum maps, monsters, NPCs, PCs, maps for several games I'm running. Then when you have your folders, you just sort them things into them. So first of all, you upload your files, then you sort them. For example, I want to upload a new map I want to use. Click Upload, you can drag files in here or choose a file. If you choose a file, it'll open a standard explorer, but you can also just drag things from anywhere and drop them in. Once it's done uploading, you can close this window. It will show up in your recent uploads down here. You can click this button right here to filter items that you've sorted or not. I prefer to keep it sorted and keep this sorted. And when you have your map, you just open it, call it whatever you want, and then put it in a folder you want it to be. That's it, sorted. Above the premium assets and library, you have the search function. You can click the question mark to see more parameters of how to search. You can select what exactly you want to search. I prefer to search everything. And just click here and type whatever you want. And it will search your library for, for anything matching the name or the tag. You can search premium assets, which you can see more and more of. And when you click them, it will take you to the marketplace asset page so you can buy them. Or it will also just pick up random things on the web using a Google search, which you can grab from right here. Just take it and drag it. To use the images, you just go to the image you want, pick whatever you want and take it, drag it into place. It will show up on the map and from here you can resize it and do whatever you want to it as per any token. About handling tokens, see a later video. This works the same way with maps. I will do another video about how to use maps correctly. One more note about the upload is while you have the upload window open and you click to choose a file, you can only choose one file, but if you drag and drop into this, then you can choose multiple files, which is probably what you want to do. And that's it for images. Thank you and see you in the next video.